I just got news a few minutes ago that the King of Thailand passed away yesterday. And so we want to dedicate our meditation to him. It's a rare individual who has that amount of power and uses it so well. It's the kind of thing that should be honored. We look around us and there are very few people who have the power or the influence and then use it for the sake of the people at large, not just for their own sake. And so it's good to remember the goodness of those people and to try to carry it on. Even though we may not have his power, we may not have his influence. But we do have our own range of power in our lives and our own range of influence, and we want to use it well. In other words, the example of the good people from the past becomes a pattern for us to live by, and that's how we keep their memory alive and keep their goodness alive. So we think of them when they've passed away and hope that they've gone to a good place. Make whatever merit we can and dedicate it to that purpose in terms of generosity, virtue, and especially the meditation. It's because it's the quality of the mind that sends these things. And so you make sure the quality of your mind is good. If you want to offer something to someone else, you want to offer something that's of value. So put your mind in a state that is of value. Centered, still, clear. And then dedicate that to the other person. That way the goodness stays here, the goodness that we dedicate to them. If they know about it, they express their appreciation or they feel their appreciation. That becomes their merit. But at the same time, it's our fellowship as human beings that reminds us that when we have power, when we have wealth, there are good ways and there are bad ways to use it. And when someone uses their wealth and power in a good way, and the King's been doing this consistently for many, many, many years, that something should be honored and passed on to let other people know that there are people like this in the world. When you see people like this, when you see examples like this, it encourages you to take whatever wealth you have and whatever influence you have, however large or small, and try to use it for the best purpose as possible. Because our time on earth is very short. Even if you live to be 100 years, it's still very short. But at the very end, you say, where is the time? The time is gone. Time eats itself up at the same time that it eats every, all living beings up. That's a phrase you hear often in Thailand. What lasts, though, is our goodness. What can last also is if we don't do good things, is the bad karma we do, and that can last as well. So try to build something that's good, that will last, both for the sake of other people and for yourself. Goodness is something you want to spread around.